this is Sims, and we are back with more of The Sims 4 Fractured, which is our Disney Villain Legacy Challenge. I was got distracted because I was thinking I wanted to come in before I started this and make sure we put this back on normal lifespan. Uh, gameplay, normal. Okay. Yep. I just wanted to make sure. So I totally forgot that we graduated. We haven't graduated yet. Um, But anyway, so Gray is upstairs sleeping. We are going to go to graduation, which is tomorrow um and then what we'll do is we'll ask uh paxton on a date we'll propose we'll get married and oh my god can we come over here and sell this who made painted this holly thanks i'm gonna come sell this for money go sell holly's painting you need social so we're gonna have you go talk to the cat i'm avoiding looking at the house because the house is Oh, we need to come mop this, and then we need to uh, give the pet a treat, and we need to pet our kitty, and we need to talk to the cat. Um, lecture about eating human food? Sure. Um, so I put those rugs back. I kind of moved some stuff. So this is the same as it was. I don't know. I don't really want to undo this room, but we're going to have to when Paxton and Gray have kids. But maybe not. I don't know. I really love it. But I mean, I guess it's not going to kill me to get rid of all the stuff. So the bathroom and everything's the same. Um, so here's the thing. Let's go into build and let's go see this motherfucker in the daytime. Because we had so much money and I even... okay. Here's the weird thing. Every time I went into the household inventory, there was just shit in the household inventory. I don't know where it came from. So I got rid of it. So that gave me extra money. We had too much money. I loaded this game and I deleted like 200 and I took, it was like negative 265,000 simoleons because we had almost $600,000 left. I don't need that much fucking money. We've done the whole fucking house. Like everything is done in this bitch. So, um, Walls, everything up, like the outside's done. I mean, I guess we could technically probably do some backyards, but like everything is done. So our house has been totally refurbished and looks fucking beautiful. And I love it. Like, I know it's very dark, but I like that. So it's dark with white accents, but um, we even have like a little swing out here. Now we could put some other stuff out here maybe. Um, and we can do some other like whatevers. But at any rate, this is the outside of our house. So all the plants and everything are done around the outside. We could probably put a pool in, you know, back here and whatnot. Um, so yeah. So our house though is basically like fucking done. It's fucking done. Like, um, this is around the side of, our, I mean, you can't see cause of the fucking trees. Hold on. There we go. Um, cause we keep going up on trees, but like, you know, so everything is just, done i left everything the way it was i just changed colors and rechanged the paint and everything like that um but yeah so we've got our and we can put more furniture and stuff out here i guess but so we've got our entryway so i'm not going to do this like going through so we come in in our doorway so we've got like a little entryway this is a little i put a wall there to make it a little more private for the cat oh oh whoops okay hold on hold on we forgot to paint a wall Okay, so we forgot the stairs. There we go. All right, there we go. And we could probably put family photos or something up. Um, but we've got, like, our umbrella rack and everything like that. Some of our vines are coming through, but, like, whatever. This is a, one of the paintings Gray did at college. So we just got a little seating area. And, again, we can put some other stuff in here. But I was like, all right, I had done too much stuff. So, like, this isn't as amazing as it could be. But it is what it is for now. So then in here, this is the way it always was. I put that painting up here. And again, we can decorate more stuff here, but like whatever. Um, and this is all the same. The only thing I did was move that easel uh, because we're going to need more room for maybe some more kid kind of friendly stuff. And like whatever, that didn't change. Kitchen didn't change. Our backyard changed though. So we have this patio area out here now. So we can come out here and grill. Um... And we got a nice little table out here. Uh, I put some chairs around the puppet theater that was here. And then we've got just like a little seating area here. And then there's just some planter things by the tree. Like whatever. The backyard wasn't. I don't know. Anyway. So the only other thing that we had to do, which I wanted to do, um, aside from the bedroom, I mean downstairs, is Gray's office. So 
This is the painting that Paxton did for him. So he put it there. He's got all of his posters and stuff. And I put the shelf up. So he's got all these photos up. Um, and some of them are on the nailed to the frames obviously like whatever um so his little desk over here where he can do stuff so i use the chair from tiny living i fucking love the fact that we've got purple okay i'm excited it's fucking purple i love it so um i used it because i knew it was purple and it actually kind of matches the desk pretty well for being a custom content desk so um and then we just got this little area over here with all of our other little art stuff our easel that was in the living room we put here. This um, is going to be a wall for any paintings and stuff that we do that we want to keep. So that's why it's bland and boring. Uh, and then this is his main painting area over here with, again, our posters from school. And then so and this was all stuff that was upstairs. And his violin. And then upstairs, um, I just painted this area. There's really nothing going on here and I put our box there so I guess we could put paintings and photos and stuff up his room's still the same and then this will be Gray and Paxton's room so we have the bed area over here um, with their nightstands and obviously he can get into it I did test everything in here we've got just our little mirror area we've got our dresser and then we've just got a little book area over here now hopefully he can send that chair I tried it's really hard with this fucking footstool let me use that stuff from tiny living <laughs> some of the stuff from tiny living's cool like these things but like i have no intention oh and then this is um yeah that's another one that paxton did so we put it in our bedroom and then our picture of us together <laughs> i love it uh he can at least sit in this chair they can get to the books i'm not 100 percent sure if they can sit in that chair because i was having a hard time having this where you could get around the bed i don't know like whatever so i want you to be because i didn't want it like way out in the room it needs to be sitting here but if i put it here then you can't sit in the chair and you can't get it so whatever it doesn't matter as long as you can sit or read the books but every time I told him to go read the books it wasn't like he couldn't get to this he just would go to go to a different bookshelf so not 100% sure but whatever um but like yeah I love it I like our house and I love the outside I just absolutely fucking love this like I love the fact that everything is so dark like it's dark navy blue with the black and then we just have the white windows and everything because the windows and everything like, you know, there's not, there's, I mean, black, and then there's, like, the brown. There's black, brown, and white, basically, like, without getting the run-down-looking ones. And we had changed everything to white, like, because they were white. We changed them to the nicer white, like, we painted them. So when I was doing the trim, I was like, well, wait, and I, I don't know, I just did everything like this, and then I was like, oh, the dark, I don't know, I just like the juxtaposition of the fact that everything's like that, so... Anyway, that's our house. Everything's pretty much fucking done. So, like, um, yeah, I don't, is our cat, no, we needed social. Did our cat need social or did we just need social? Um, where are you going? Oh, he's going to finish mopping and then we're going to come here and talk to the cat and maybe play with the laser pointer and praise kitty. Sure. And then we'll go pee. Now, yeah, we could always use a second bathroom or something, but I don't really want to kind of mess up the house. Like, I mean, I've already changed it by adding this bathroom and kind of changing the way, because I think there was like a wall here and this was all just open. And so now we've got that. Because um, the only other way to do it, because I don't think we could put a door here where there were two doors and then this would be like for some reason like a smaller bathroom you know what I mean like we could put so this would be like a really narrow hall to get to this bedroom or we put a wall here and you come into the bedroom here you know what I mean like if there was a wall here and then this were the door into this bedroom well no you couldn't do that yeah you know what I mean like we could make it small we could probably rearrange it so you could get into the bedroom here so we cut off this so this the bathroom would be smaller this would be part of the bedroom where you get in this is a bathroom and we'd have to put the door there but i mean what's the point why don't you don't need two bathrooms upstairs um but it's going to be more complex with more people living here but this was also really huge for a bathroom so i don't really know where we could build another bathroom unless we moved this and you come in here and then this was just a tiny little half kind of bath here. But then this window would be really fucking weird. We would just have to not have that window there. You know what I mean? 
And I realized that these aren't placed properly when I was doing it. I was moving some around there. Some are higher than others and some are like further away from the wind. But I was like, I, now it's going to annoy me, but <laughs> it looked fine when you, when I downloaded that, I was like, it's not perfect, but yeah, I mean, I, I guess we could put like a tiny little half bath here, right? Cause this is like at least two tiles, right? Yeah, so we could always put, like, tiny little half bath here, but I don't really want to, I don't know, I think I really want to do that, even if this came in a little, I don't know. Uh, there's not really any conveniently easy place, unless we moved the front door to here, and then this area by the stairs was a bathroom, you know what I mean? Like, this becomes the front door. But then it would look weird. I think I'm fine with it. If it gets really bad, where we have too many... Because we're going to have... He's going to be here for a while. Paxton's going to be in here. And then we're going to have two kids. We're going to have five Sims in here in one bathroom. That's going to be a lot. But, I mean, for a while, we're going to have toddlers. Sebastian might not live to see his grandkids. Like, fully. He's going to be an elder in 11 days. He's going to be an adult in 18. So, I mean, yeah, well, I mean, because we're going to end up having one of our kids pretty soon. So he will be around for at least one of them. Well, he should be around for both of them. 11 days. I mean, I don't like before he becomes an elder. So, yeah, he'll probably see at least both of them be born at any rate. So and that's true. Paxton's going to die after the second one. Oh, God. Paxton has to die. Spouse dies at the second kid. I just don't... We're going to have to wait a while because I don't think I want Paxton to die that soon, but we're going to have to do it. I don't, <laughs> I don't like this challenge anymore. <laughs> I love it, but I hate it because, like... So it was great when you start because, like, Sebastian was such a douche hole and you were like, what a jerk! And, like, he's an asshole! And, like, these were all things that were in our inventory. You know what I mean? And like, but then he kind of redeemed himself and you were like, oh, that's so great. And now his life is okay. Right. And then like poor Gray had like kind of a terrible, like you start, his life started out okay. Cause he was living with his mom, but then his mom dies, which is kind of traumatic. And he moves in with Sebastian living in this rundown fucking house. And he's like, what the fuck? This sucks. And then everything's off. And then he goes to college and then he's maybe kind of seeing someone, but then like weird things. And then it like, so his life has kind of been like up and down, like a lot, like a fucking roller coaster. His life has been a fucking roller coaster. But everything is kind of working out now. You know what I mean? Like, he's going to graduate with his degree. He's going to have a great job. He's freaking in love with Paxton. They're going to be together. Everything's going to be wonderful. He won the lottery. And then he's going to end up marrying Paxton. They're going to have kids. And then Paxton's going to die. And then he's got to basically, like, we're just going to have, he's going to have to start drinking all the time because his kids are going to have to, like, grow up thinking that, like, dad hates them. I mean, because whoever takes over, it's going to have two kids. Whoever takes over, whether it be the oldest or the youngest, is going to have resentment. It's either going to be the oldest resenting with the younger one, like, well, <laughs> like, dad favored you because you were the baby and, like, whatever. Or the younger one's going to be like, dad hated me because I killed other dad. Like, I don't know what's going to happen. Like, but he's got to be kind of standoffish with both his fucking kids, like, at a certain point. So, I mean, and we've got to have a monetary aspiration, but I kind of want him to finish this before we get into that. So he has to complete five masterpieces. Is not the end? Yeah, we're good. Um, so you're going to do that. What's this? Paint on an easel. We can do that. So you're going to eat. When does graduation happen? I don't know. This is till 2 a.m. So, okay. That's fine. And the cool thing is, though, so, I mean, we're here in this house. Everything's already done. So the only thing I could think is I'm not going to have him move out. But because I wanted to, like, do it, redo it. So, like, now that the house is done, we'll have the kids. Whichever one of the kids is the heir, maybe they should move out and move into another one of the rundown houses so they can refurb that one. 
because I like doing this house flipper shit. Like, um, wait a minute. Why is that not clear? Okay, hold on. Boop. There we go. <laughs> I guess I forgot to recolor that. Um, can you go? Uh-oh. Take a shower. You're sleeping. I heard you took an IQ test and they said the results were negative. <laughs> People are fucking harsh. What was that from creepy text? How did that person get my number? I mean, I don't know. Okay, so... I don't know if... Um, when does graduation happen? Graduation is supposed to be today, but I don't know... Graduation ceremony at 1038. Okay, cool. There we go. So when you're done with that, we'll have you use that. I thought of you and started blushing. <laughs> Thanks, dude. You're making me blush. <laughs> I love them so much, and I hate the fact that I've got to rip their family apart. It's going to suck. I'm not going to be able to do this. It's going to be really hard, and I love Paxton a lot, and I'm very sad that I have to murder him. Um... Oh, and our easel is also sticking out of our window. Okie dokie, whatever. All right, so let's do a flirty painting. And let's try to move our easel back into the fucking house. I don't know how this happened. You know what? There we go, we'll just do that. There we go. I think it's because it that extends past the edge of the thing. So you are going to work. Angry, of course, but you're off to work. Oh, no, 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 sweetie, go to work. Go to work, sweet cheeks. You're scheduled for a promotion. Well, you didn't fill out your reports and you didn't reach level two. Um, oh, and you got to come down here and do a flirty painting. Oh, okay, I didn't see it. It was hiding. Uh, what level are you? Level five, I mean. Graduation ceremony starts soon. Yay, okay. Good lord, can you hurry up and come do a painting so then we can go to a graduation? We're gonna... I don't know if we get to go with you because we're not living on campus. I mean, I think we could go. And then we'll call Paxton and ask him out on a date. Um, it'd be amazing if this was a masterpiece. I love this one together, the llama and the freezer bunny, and I think we need to hang this on our wall. Um... The graduation ceremony, would you like to attend? Yes. <laughs> He's so excited. Paxton better have graduated too. Oh my God, is he going to be there? <laughs> I love this series so much. I hope we don't get bored of it. Like, I hate it when I'm invested in like a series and a game that I'm playing and then all of a sudden I'm like, I'm bored with this. But I really... I think the fun thing about this one is I love our Sims. I kind of like the fact that we're trying to build up the house while we're doing it. It's because it gives us something to work for. And the fact that I'm, I am trying to stick to the script a little. Uh, you know what I mean? Sort of. Like, Gray was supposed to be materialistic and a snob, have a money aspiration, and all those things. He doesn't have the money aspiration. We'll give it to him once he completes the Master Painter one. Because I really want him to finish that. Um, since it fit who he was as a child. And I don't care if he maxes the money aspiration, but like, we've done everything else. Like, are you wearing heels? You're wearing kind of heeled kind of boots. Where are you going? Oh, you're going to the gym on this side. Oh my God. I'm so excited. Where in the hell? Attend graduation. Let's just attend graduation. Stop psyching people up. Let's just go. Let's just graduate. Let's just get this over with so I can. Let's just graduate. Hey, great. It's me, Paxton. Do you want to go on a date? Oh, Paxton, yes, but we got to graduate first. I got to graduate first, and then I'll ask you on a date. I'm so sorry, sweet cheeks, but I can't leave. No. Attend graduation. Stop trying to talk to these people. Just fucking go graduate, would you? I don't care. Like, stop. Attend graduation. Stop talking to these fucking people. I hate these people. Stop. For fuck's sake, just fucking attend graduation. Stop talking to these fucking assholes. 
God, it's so irritating. It's like, celebrate. I don't fucking care. Just fucking graduate. I don't want to sit here all day and cheer with these people. Fucking graduate. Like, 20 minutes later, okay, I guess I'll go. No, that's what you should have been doing. Like, I'm here. I want to just go in and graduate. I don't want to talk to these people. Woohoo, we're graduating. Yeah, cool. Yeah, that's nice. That's nice. If I didn't want to rush this because I want to just get through the graduation so we can go ask our fucking boy toy on a goddamn date and then get married. It's not that fucking complicated. Like, goddamn it, Gray, you're fucking everything up. It's all these assholes wanting to celebrate with us. See, he's flirty and he wants to... He's feeling flirty. Oh, we missed him, like, throwing his hat. Because I was super speeding through. All right, cool. Let's now go. That guy's doing his homework. Dude, you just graduated. Send a flirty text. We can't ask him out on a date. What's this? Seriously? Gray seems to have upset some sims. Expect some nasty texts. Texts. Send a flirty text. So then now he will ask you out on a date. Don't be like getting flirty with this guy. Maybe we should hang out and grab a drink. Yeah, I wanted to go to a romantic place with you, but I guess we can go have a drink, and then if this doesn't count as a date, we will ask you on a date while we're here. Um, we got to find a romantic place to go, because, like, the romance festival needs to be in town. I wish you could set festivals. You know what I mean? Like, I wish you could be, like, if it's Love Day, the romance festival should be in town. It's fun that the romance festival is, like, off of... But it should be around. You know what I mean? I kind of do wish you could set... You actually... Well, you can kind of set up festivals. Kawaii Stacy does have a mod for that. You have to put it on a lot as a lot trait. Why the fuck are we actually here? This is stupid. Okay. Uh, MC Command Center. Dresser is what I was looking for. Change outfit. Let's put on our... Let's see. What's our party outfit look like? No, that's not nearly good. A formal outfit? Hell yes, let's put on this. Then let's be enticing. Where the fuck did he go? You son of a fucking bitch. Invite him to hang out. Why the fuck would you leave me here right when I was about to be enticing and ask you out on a fucking date? God damn it, Paxton. You are ruining this now. Everyone is trying to ruin this for us. Paxton, damn well better be right over. Who's that? Paxton? Paxton? Girl? The fuck are you? There you are. Passionate kiss. Go! He just left us again! Son of a bitch! I am not having a good time right now. Paxton is busy. What is he fucking doing? All right. Travel. We are going to take Paxton with us, whether he fucking likes it or not. It is love. No. <laughs> Damn it, Paxton. Fucking A. No, you're not fucking busy. You are not fucking busy. Oh, my. Son of a bitch. <laughs> <gasps> oh, I'm so fucking mad. Paxton, I'm so mad at you. I'm so fucking mad at you. Why are you fucking busy? Fuck you, no you're not. Did he get a job? Maybe he got a job, but no. You were quitting that job and you were going out with me. I'm gonna fucking stab you, Paxton. You little son of a bitch. You are ruining my plans for this episode. <gasps> Ooh! God, I just... Ugh. I'm so angry right now. I'm so fucking mad. I need you to fucking come here. Send him a flirty text. You need to get here and marry my ass in the back of this fucking estate. I am going to fucking scream... You son of a bitch. I, how do I, fo oh, you know what I can do? Hold on. I'm just going to force him here. 
I can do that with MC Command Center, you son of a bitch. He's busy. With who? Paxton, no, you're not. Okay, MC Command Center. Commands teleport world sim to this sim. Paxton. Pause. More choices. Actions. Add to group. Dag, dag. No! No, you're not leaving. You are not fucking leaving, Paxton. You are not fucking leaving. Give a love day gift. Do we have anything that we can give him? <gasps> we can give him a rose. Paxton, you are not leaving. More choices. Romance. Ask on a date. Woo! <laughs> like, Paxton is not leaving. I will not let you fucking leave. Also, I am not letting you be hungry. You're not hungry. You're fine. We have to get married. If we can't stay here, I'm going to be kind of mad. Let's stay here. We're traveling here. Good. Are we on a date now? Good. Sexy pose. Share love day spirit. Kiss his hands. Suave kiss. We need to sit and talk to our date. Passionate kiss. Caress cheeks. Be enticing. He's not leaving. He will not leave. Now... Kiss his neck. Okay, hold on. Hold on. We have to sit and talk to our date. So let's sit together there. And then let's find a nice... Let's go maybe... This is a lovely lot because it's actually a wedding venue. But like... Snobbily surrounded. Yes, well, this is the perfect place for you to propose to your love. By the beautiful fountain vibes. Or should we... I was thinking we venture back here to this lovely area, propose and get married. Because we don't have... I mean, there's like some lovely places here, but let's go into the lot. I mean, there's fucking... Let's sit and talk. We gotta get him flirty. Why is he not flirty? Tease flirtatiously. He's very confident. Kiss him. Look at this. Make out a little. Compliment his appearance. Appearance. There we go. More choices. Friendly. Ask about his day, because that's sitting and talking with our date. Whisper sweet nothings. Lovely. Flirt. More choices. Um, is it romantic to give a massage? There we go. This is a lovely date. You're going to have to get in your formal wear for the wedding, though. Um, MC Command Center. Dresser. Let's put you in your fabulous... Is that your formal wear? Your formal wear is not prepared for a wedding. It's Oh my god, but you look fucking adorable together, so I love it. <laughs> Make a move. Aida. We've already gotten gold. More choices. Romance. Okay, hold on. We can do this. Where's fucking propose, goddammit? There it is. Here we go. Here we go. This is it. <laughs> this is it! This is gonna be the best date ever! Look at them looking at each other. Oh. Oh my god, just hold on. Can we just can we just look at them looking at each other? This is fucking amazing. Look at the way Gray is just looking at him. Like, look at just just look at this. Just look at the way they look at each other. Oh, get you someone to look at you the way they look at each other. <laughs> I'm so jealous. I'm so jealous of these two. I love them. Oh my god, I love this so much. Alright, ready? Wait, what are you doing? 
receive a gift. Oh, he's going to give us a gift. Oh, oh, is he? Well, there's no romance bush here, so I mean, I guess it's not what I think it is. Oh, uh -huh. <laughs> Suave kiss, and then we'll uh, <laughs> embrace him. Uh -huh. More choices. <laughs> romance. We were going to propose, but we just... There we go. Oh. Look at how fucking amazing they are. I love that. All right, here we go. All right. He's like, all right. Serba, you may? Love day. It literally just sounded like he said love day. <laughs> They're so excited. See what? Oh. Oh. And there's a mad guy in the background. Oops. Not, not what I meant to do. Um. Oh. <laughs> Oh, I love them so much. Steffies. Wait, hold on. Pause. While they're talking and doing that, let's come over here. Now, I know that there's plenty of, like, wedding arches and stuff here, but I like, I want to go to the one way the frick out here, because we never do this. And this is a beautiful private area. Let's go here together. Okay. Paxton better fucking come there. Where are you going? Paxton, you better go there. You better be going there with us. Okay, good. Paxton's running. He knows exactly what's coming. Sorry, like... Run, boys, run! Run to your future together! Okay, can we... Get married to Paxton. Get married right now. <laughs> Woo and wed fast! God, oh... <laughs> oh. Oh, guys, it's beautiful. Ah, brink of Vince. Oh, I love this. This is the gayest thing ever. Oh, <laughs> Bellino. Merge, Ooh. Malfoy, <laughs> Yemple Stuvan. No. It's like he's, like, terrible at this. Like, he doesn't know. Like, he's awkward. Happy <sighs> name. Oh. Boy. <sighs> the name. Uh -oh. oh, hello. Well. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what a beautiful ceremony. It really is. Okay. Let's do that. Oh, we just made 20 grand. Oh, dear God. We didn't need that. Okay. All right. We can just get rid of that. Oh, that's fine. We didn't need money. <laughs> oh, I love this. <laughs> this is so beautiful. <laughs> Let's go sleep crew together in a bush. <laughs> More choices. Yeah. Romance. Oh, what? Let's let, let, what? Wait, 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 wait. Wayne soup. Take romantic selfie. Oh, wait. Can we take a romantic? I've never tried. I've had passionate romance in there for a while. It was in the wrong folder. I finally moved it. But I don't know. I've never used any of the stuff for it. So we definitely need a... Oh my god, we're wearing the same shoes. <gasps> Do I get to... Actually... Oh, 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 okay, okay. So that, that's not... That, that didn't work. Okay, let's try that again. More choices. Passionate romance. Let's, let's try that again, but maybe, like, actually do a pose where it works. Oh. Okay, but Paxton's not in the selfie. Okay, never mind. <laughs> So never mind. It's fine. It's not working perfectly. But let's um we I do want to actually have them take a photo with Paxton. Let's just do that. I mean a romantic well, selfie would be nicer, know. but at least this one works. <laughs> it's not romantic, but it's adorable and it's their It's their wedding photo, guys. We should actually have Sebastian take a photo of them. Let's let's try the romantic selfie one more time and see what happens. And see if it... Okay, see, they're, like, posed together properly, but... Like... <laughs> it's not working. I wonder if it's because that thing's in the way. Let's try... Hold on a second. <laughs> okay, well... Not every mod's gonna be perfect. Let's go here together. And then let's try it. 
It worked better than the first time, the last couple times. But, like, they're posing almost perfectly together. Like this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. This is not working. All right. Never mind. Forget I asked. Okay, forget I fucking asked. That is, uh, let's just go hook up in the bush. He's like, hey, now that we got married, I can't wait to get you home. So there's a bush around the corner. Let's go. He's like, all right. I don't know if hooking up in a bush. Okay, I'm, I'm pretty sure hooking up in a bush is just woohooing and not trying for a baby. I don't think we're ready there. Look, if it happens, it happens. But I don't want it to happen right this second because I'm kind of afraid of... Look, they're going through the maze. It's cute. Oh, I always forget you can click on the snail and wander the maze. Oh, that's... I always forget about that. All right, let's get it on, boys. Well, that sounds inappropriate. I mean, we are watching the Wuhuna bush, for fuck's sake, so... The lovely, like... I mean, we could always have... Look, we could... Oh, that was not a Wuhuna bush. That's a Wuhuna bush. We could go Wuhu in that one? And then we can go, you know, it's like I never come here. And then, like, you can come a wander over here. Like, wow. Come ten gardens. I always forget that this place exists. I mean, like, I it's not that I forgot that it exists. I kind of forget about the maze and all that. Where the hell are they? Which bush are they in this one? Okay. Why is Sebastian here? Legendary date. Sebastian, why are you here? Why did... What? No, seriously, but... Why are you here? Sebastian, sweetie, baby, honey, child, why? Um... You should actually have a date with someone. Uh... Oh, you know what? I have an idea. Let's just see, is it under social? Social. Let's go on the Simda dating app and let's go on a date. Let's just find someone. Uh, well, we can't get back together with like Finley. We could do a blind date. Let's just go on a blind date. Let's do that. That scares me. It scares me the idea of we're going on a blind date, but we can do romantic. We can do some love day stuff and like Sebastian can get some flirting out of his system because he hasn't. Okay. We're going with this strange dude. Um, let's just stay here. Now, where's our date? I don't know where he is. Can we, let's say, go here together and then maybe he'll show up. Like, you could have... I know you're hungry, Sweet Cheeks, but, like, I don't know where your date is. Oh, here he comes. All right, well, cool. We got a blind date. Lovely. I don't know where he is. Um, we should have gone someplace where we could have eaten. So who's this? Bruno. Oh, hello, Bruno. Hello, Bruno. Uh, flirty introduction. Bruno has some fucking cheekbones, that's for sure. All right, let's see. Give a love day gift. Uh, do we have, like, flowers? Oh, we do. We have a rose. Let's give him a rose. Um, sweet talk. We got to get some love day stuff in here. That's more important than the bright and day. Um, more choices. Okay, well, he did that. Compliment appearance. I hate the fact that I can't see, you know what I mean? Like, did you just proposition that man already? I want to, can we like sing about Love Day or? Romance. Compliment appearance. That's kind of flirting. Kiss. We could do that. Uh, kiss hands. 
do, 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 do. Throw love day confetti. I want to make sure we get the love day stuff more than like dating this guy. You know what I mean? Heartfelt compliment. Pick up line. Ask about day. And Gray's like, Dad, what the fuck? Let's go sit together. Gray's still here with Paxton. But, so, okay, you know what? No, there's something else wrong. There is some other glitch in the Matrix of some mod that I put in because my like they can't go home because there's an event happening. Like, I understand that Sebastian showed up here, but Sebastian, was he here the whole time? Ooh, like, uh, brag about job title? Sure. We've already got a legendary date, so that's good. Um, we've already got a legendary date, so I'm going to end it early. I don't really care if it's bad. I just wanted to make sure you had a good love day. So, gold medal, woohoo! Okay, cool. Um, but the thing that I don't understand is why, because they were here. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, hold on. You need to give flowers. You've already done that though. Um, give Love Day gift. You already gave him flowers, though, but I guess we'll just give flowers again. And then... Discuss favorite art pieces. Recite love poetry. Sure. Get over here and do this. But, like, it's really weird because I don't know what's impacting and why my Sims go on dates with their whole family, like, lately. Like, I, I've updated mods... But I updated them. So, like, Sebastian should not have been here when they went on a date. And Paxton and Gray should have been able to go home because they weren't part of a group. You know what I mean? Like, can you go home? Sweetie, go home. You come back to our house now. I love you. I just don't understand why all my Sims are going on dates together. I updated mods. I had... I put in... I don't know. I don't know why my Sims have just decided that they are going on dates together. You know what? I wonder if it's the Sim to app. Because both times I've used it, my Sims family has come. They have shown up when I've done outings or gone other places, and then it's like, well, go fucking home. Why are you here? But, well, no, because... I don't think my sim... She was hanging out with friends. I don't remember if I couldn't send him home then. But I know the two times I went on a sim to dating with my... F I chose that. The twice I've done that today... I've chosen Sim to dating app, whether it was a blind date or a planned date, every one of my family came with me. <laughs> in this case, there was only one Sim, and in the other one, there was only two. But every fucking Sim... Hold on, can we... Where's our good camera? Well, I guess this is the only one we have. Take a photo of... Pa no, shit. No, 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 no. Oh, crap. I gotta... Okay, we gotta set up a thingamajiggy somewhere. How are we gonna fit this? Um, You know what? Let's see if we can... Actually, I don't care if that's in the way. Like, that's behind them. So let's put this here. No, but I wanna... Ugh, fuck. I wish you could without... Can you do this without the thingy? Hold on. Can you take a... F no. Hold on. No. Why can't I take a photo? Here we go. Take a picture of... Can you... Why can't I take a picture of... Pa oh, he's sleeping. Okay, hold on. Get up for a second. Can I take a picture of these two? Oh, I can. Okay. Okay. But you, I need to, you need to be 
MC Command Center, Dresser, Change Outfit. I need you in your formal that you got married in. Because I need you taking, I need you to take formal photos. I need you to take photos of our grooms. No, bitches, go take photos. Stop eating. Stop eating and go take a fucking photo. Okay, there you go. Now, don't be tired and don't be stupid. Don't yawn and don't look dumb. I mean, that's fucking adorable. Not gonna lie. We do need a big photo, but we need to... Can we... Oh, romantic. That's not romantic. I mean, that actually is fucking cute as shit. But I want that to be like this. No. Okay, hold on. I want a romantic fi picture. Oh, that's fucking adorable. That's kind of cute, but it doesn't, like, it's not, it's not going to fit, like. I wish we could. Oh, we can. Oh, we can't. Oh, hold on. There we go. We can kind of move like this a little bit. That's kind of cute. Well, there's not a lot of good romantic poses, are there? Like, they're not changing. It's literally just flipping them back and forth. I mean, that's fucking kind of adorable. <laughs> that's fucking hilarious. I love that. The romantic poses aren't the best, but... um. And actually, that's not even a... It doesn't even register as a romantic pose, but, uh... It's really... Okay. Oh! Oh! Look at how fucking cute they are! I want a really good one that we can, like... That's not terrible for like a bigger one, but it doesn't look the best. I really wish there was more, but that's literally the only one we keep getting. I mean, that is cute. Don't get me wrong, but like, that actually is kind of cute to be dead honest with you. I'm not going to lie. I'm like, that's cute. Um, They're adorable. These are all super fashiony photos, but I want like relaxed. How about not excited? Because excited doesn't do a lot, but I really wish there were better romantic poses. There's literally only those two. That's it. Like, that's it. There's just those two. That's fucking irritating. There should be a cuter one. Like, I'm just saying, like, okay, maybe a relaxed one. Now it needs to be like this. No, whoops. I meant it needs to be like this. That's actually kind of cute. That's adorable. Okay. <laughs> Dweebs. <laughs> okay, I'm not going to lie. I fucking just love that. <laughs> That's hilarious. Hold on. <laughs> fucking amazing wait 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 no I really I wanted like another like but I <laughs> okay like there's not any really good romantic poses but like I wish there were better ones but that's fucking hilarious that's fun to do actually okay put that in your inventory Put that in your inventory, and you can come up here and go to sleep. My game is, like, really glitchy. Um, it's 50 minutes in. Okay, so, anyway, I am going to wrap this part up here. Uh, I will see you guys next time. Remember to give the video a big thumbs up, and subscribe to see more. Oh, my God, he's still in class. Fuck! Shit!
God damn it. I didn't know he was still in class. He was supposed to have been done. Oh. All right. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.